Hi friends! Um, so here's a little background before I start the vlog. Um, if you don't want to watch like the background or information, you can just skip to. Basically, I have been tube fed for like over a year. It started with nasal feeding tubes and then I got a surgical feeding tube. Um, so I've had that one since December and it's because I was completely unable to eat due to chronic illnesses and then I got a major surgery and now I can eat. Um, so I'm finally able to sustain myself orally and I don't need to rely on a feeding tube anymore. Um, I've been able to eat orally for four months now, but they wanted to leave the tube in to make sure that it would last. So now I've officially passed all the requirements and I get to remove my feeding tube. So today I'm getting my surgical feeding tube removed and I'm so excited. So I thought I'd just kind of take you, take you through my day. Um, taking meds right now. Okay, let's do an outfit change. Okay, here we go. And here's my feeding tube right now. It has a tubey pad on it. This is what it looks like without the tubey pad. I got dressed and apparently I'm supposed to take a shower before this but nobody told me so um I'll go shower um comment ideas for what I should do with all the rest of my tubi pads now that I can't use them and I can't donate them because they're all used and that would be really unsanitary okay hi friends I'm in the car we just drove an hour we're at University of Michigan and we're almost there So the next clip is going to be the actual tube removal, so it is a little gross, so just content warning if you're squeamish, maybe don't watch, um, but yeah. Um, so here's a video of the actual tube removal. So first we deflate the balloon that's holding the tube in place, um, so we're drawing out its contents. Um, before the procedure started, they gave me some numbing cream, but they didn't give me pain meds or anything, that's okay, it wasn't terrible. Oh, and the tube I have is a GJ feeding tube, I don't think I mentioned that earlier. Okay, so now they're gonna pull out the tube. It is super long and it was really uncomfortable and weird feeling coming out. Um, cannot describe it, but don't recommend. It honestly hurt a ton less than I expected, which was really good. Uh, here's my face right after. <laughs> I look like I'm in shock. Okay, so now you can see like the actual place where the tube used to be. Um, so the hole closes really quickly. I have to keep a dressing on it, um, but it should close within the week. Um, and I'll have a scar. It kind of looks like a little funky second belly button. Um, and now we're prepping the skin and now we're putting silver nitrate on it. So it kind of burns, but it cauterizes the wound and helps prevent infection and helps encourage it to heal. If after a week it hasn't fully healed and is still like oozing stuff and not closing, um, I have to go in for surgery to close it, so really hoping it heals on its own. Now we're putting some cream on it and they're putting a dressing on and um, I basically have to just keep changing the dressing for a little bit, um, only a couple days and then I get to just remove the dressing and yeah. Overall it was less painful than I expected but it definitely still hurt. Um, not a pleasant feeling, but also not like terrible. I'm so thankful that the amazing nurse let me film this. She was so sweet, um, so thank you. Okay, so the rest of the vlog is gonna be like my day after doing this, so if you don't want to watch that, you can end here. Thank you so much for watching. Um, here I am without a feeding tube. I am so, so, so happy. And I was trying to record a video and I put it in slow mo, so just enjoy. So the tube is out and we left the hospital and now we're gonna go drive to get some food. Um, so we just ate lunch and ooh, the lighting is really bad. Hi, um, so we just finished lunch and now we're driving back home. Okay, um, I just took a really good nap. I'm not really in pain anymore. I'll have to change the dressing at some point. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'll probably be posting updates about um, how it's healing on my Instagram, so follow that for more information. It's at Cawthorn. Um, we're gonna order sushi tonight as a little celebration. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a lovely day.